Good day, my little robins. It's me, Beth. Another week has passed, which means you get another video from well, me on this channel. And as you can tell, it is the end of September, which means I'm bringing you guys another Q and A. I like doing these because I get to answer questions, you know, submitted to you, not only on you know the comment section on YouTube, but on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, Wattpad. All the links to my social media are in the description box below. So if you want to ask me a question, you know, in a future video then just drop it down below. You might learn something new about me. Wow, I can't believe September's already come to an end. Like that Green Day song, wake me up when September ends. Hashtag relevant. I do not know what kind of mood I'm in today, so apologies in advance. Before we begin, if you want to support me and the channel, you can by clicking like to show me some love. You can click subscribe because nothing's stopping you. You can tap that bell to be notified of when I upload on this glorious channel. But let's just dive right into September Q&A. <music> Question one is, what are your upcoming gigs? Well, I have a few planned for the remaining, you know, 2018. In October, I am seeing the Amity Affliction, Cross Faith and the Rasmus. In November, I am seeing Of Mice of Men and Bring Me the Horizon. And I'm still unsure about whether or not I'm going to see Berry tomorrow in December. I have seen Berry tomorrow three times, and it depends on how much money I have at the end of like November, whether or not I go see them. But I'm definitely seeing five bands, you know, for the remainder of 2018. I love me some live music. What is your most anticipated album yet to be released in 2018? I have a few albums that I'm looking forward to. I'm gonna name them. I'm looking forward to Ice Nine Kills new album, which is actually released at the start of October. I'm also really excited about Holy Hell by Architects. And my favorite band of all time, Muse, are finally releasing another album, which I think drops in November. I might be wrong, that's how much I like the band, I might be wrong about the release date, but they are the three albums I am most looking forward to for the rest of 2018. What is your favourite thing about the weather getting colder? My favourite thing personally about the weather getting colder is I get to bring out all my comfy jumpers. They are currently sitting under my bed in like boxes and I have a chest of drawers to the side of me. So I'll be taking out my summer clothes and they'll be going under the bed and they'll be replaced with all my cosy jumpers. I love like autumn, winter. I just love wrapping up nice and warm, you know, get me, you know, maybe a hot chocolate and just sit there and be like, yeah, I'm not going anywhere. Yeah, that's my favorite thing. I, 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 like I've already said at the start of the video, I don't know what kind of mood I'm in today, but that is my favourite thing, is being able to put on all my warm, lovely jumpers. Next question is, what are you reading right now? And I am actually, I'm not reading anything new, I'm actually rereading one of my favourite autobiographies, and that is America 51 by Corey Taylor. I have every single book he has written, there's just something about, you know, his writing style that just, you know, I really like. You know, he has a dark sense of humour. He is not afraid to write about controversial subjects. And this is probably my favourite book he has released. So, yes, this is what I am reading currently. Gotta love reading. Now, I don't know if I've actually answered this question before on a Q&A, but it is, what is your favourite Disney film? And, well, this is pretty obvious, my favourite Disney film is Lion King. It came out the year I was born. It is beautiful. The songs are amazing. I know pretty much every song on that film, word for word. Scar is my spirit animal, except when he kills Mufasa. That still gets me every time, and Simba's like, wake up, Dad. We have to go home and I'm just there like, I'm 24 and I'm crying my eyes out about a dead animation. Yes, 
it's my favourite Disney film. That just wraps up my September Q&A. I hope you guys, you know, learned something about me. I'm sorry about my mood if I ramble over some of my words. I'm my own unique human people, don't judge me. Like I already said at the start of the video, if you want to ask me any questions in future videos, drop a comment or you know you can follow me on social media or the links in the description box below. I love answering questions that you guys submit, so get submitting because the next one will be the end of October. Halloween, the spooky month. Yeah, if you want to support me and the channel, you can by clicking like to show me some love. You can click my face right here to subscribe to the channel because I do upload weekly. You can check out my last two videos or playlist right here, depending on what mood I'm in when I'm editing this. Until next time, I'm Beth. Keep listening to good music. Goodbye.